G'day guys. Today I've got something really special for everyone in this box right here. Now for those who don't know, um, Maffle is a premium top tier um, tool company out of Germany. Um, they do a lot of um, post and, and beam construction, a lot of log construction. Um, the, the amount of the, the variety of tools they make are second to none when it comes to those types of applications. Um, but they also make uh, construction tools um, for general carpenters. So um, you've got track saws, crosscut saws, um, drills as well. Um, but here we have uh, the jigsaw offering. Now this is the P1CC. So what I'm going to go uh, do is go through um, the features, um, the accessories and show the performance. Um, this is a very rare opportunity for me in Australia to, um, to use a tool like this. They don't have any distributors here. Um, you can only get them in Europe or North America um, or you have to um, you know, get them specially sent over and then use a plug adapter which, which I'll be using on this one. So I'm excited to get into it um, and hope you enjoy it. One of the secrets uh, to the P1 is these blades that only fit uh, the Maffle P1 jigsaw. Um, Maffle make these blades in house, uh, Swiss made. Um, and as you can see, they're pretty, pretty incredible. They're basically two jigsaw blades laminated together. They've got this special head on them, which only makes them suit the P1. The P1 will take normal jigsaw blades. This is a standard um, SDS um, quick release um, for your standard jigsaws. Um, but yeah, these things are absolutely incredible. They're, they're a really fat kerf at the front, about 3mm, but then it tapers back to a really thin kerf, and you can see the lamination in the steel, and they're stiff as a board. You can't flex them at all. Um, that That's what makes the uh, the cut just so straight, um, yet you can still do really nice curves with them um, because of this back bevel. Just absolutely incredible. And what I also want to show you is how fat this bore is. Uh, that comes down for the motor. Um, the Maffle jigsaw doesn't actually have a, a base guide at all the, um, to keep the blade in check. It relies purely on um, this bore and the stiffness of the blade. So compare it to a typical jigsaw, you can see the difference in thickness. That's, that's probably less than half. And then to put that in perspective, this is a recipro reciprocating saw it's pretty much identical so the Maffle jigsaw has the same size stroke arm or, or ball would you like um, as basically a reciprocating saw so you get absolutely zero movement in that whatsoever um, no flex doesn't get heat fatigue it's just insane now these accessories come with um, the jigsaw itself you don't have to buy um, any separate accessories so you've got your vacuum adapter, you just click straight into the back of the base, just like that. And when the vacuum is not in, you take that out and then you can plug just the copper cap in the back if you like. But it also comes with this. Now this is your guide. This is a multi-purpose guide. So when the, the red tab's down, um, it acts as, as a rip guide slides in the front of the jigsaw and you can rip now the base has two grooves they're very fine but they're the same grooves that are on the Maffle and Bosch tracks and then this guide also has one as well so you can you can set it off your track um, and do nice straight cuts um, with either the base or, or the guide another cool function let's take the blade out is you fold this out fold it down sorry but you've got this little pin that comes in in with this guide so you slide that back clip it down lock it out and then this little pin drops in to one of these holes here and then when you slide it through the jigsaw you've now got a perfect circle guide and it just pivots on that pin so you just bring it in and out and change the radius and you don't need any other accessories um, this is all included with the kit, um, which is just fantastic. And the build quality of everything is absolutely superb as well. There's no, there's no wiggle or movement. Um, it just slots straight in and it's just nice and solid, really well built stuff.
So I just use the circle jig, cut out this circle. Not only is it perfectly round all the way, but it's also perfectly square. You can't get any better. So my camera lets me focus. Look at that. It doesn't matter whereabouts on the circle you hit it with the square. It's just perfect. And even on the on the off cut. Look at that. This is like no other jigsaw I've ever come across in my life. Look at that. Doesn't matter. Anywhere on it, it's perfect. Doesn't matter where about you put the circle back. It's the same all the way around because it's the perfect circle. Doesn't matter where you start. Alright, so let's see how we went. So this is 45mm timber, H3 treated pine. We cut it pretty cleanly, so let's see how it stacks up. Oh, look at that. As square as you like. You've got to be kidding. Look at that, just absolutely perfect. Oh, the finish blew out slightly, oh no. Yeah, we got about a mil there. A mil over 45. Just absolutely insane. Same with the off cut. Look at that. <laughs> as perfect as you like. Thank you. seen in the videos this thing is like nothing else um, it's powerful it's accurate it's well balanced it's extremely well built it comes with a good array of accessories um, when you start looking at value um, with the accessories included compared to the next uh, closest tool which is the fest tool um, it's actually pretty good value um, it is the most expensive jigsaw but it is the world's best, no doubt about that. Nothing even comes close, including the, the festival. Um, I've, I've owned one, I've used it, didn't like it, um, and then this came across my way and I, I couldn't refuse. And I'm so happy I, I've, I've got the opportunity to, um, to use this. Um, I, you, you don't get these tools here in Australia. Um, they're only in, in Europe and North America, so I'm very lucky to 
for being able to use um, this uh, this jigsaw, um, and I can't recommend it highly enough. As you saw on the videos, the quality of cut, the power it's got, it's it's just like nothing else. Um, so if if you're in Europe or you're in North America and you're thinking about getting one, give your rep a call, get him to come out and, and give you a rundown through a, a site demo, um, and you will not be disappointed. If you do um, the type of work that requires such a tool, especially if you do a lot of curve work, you will not regret this thing. It's absolutely insane. Um, the only downside, um, it's not even a big one, is it doesn't have an LED light. Um, a couple of blokes online have um, stuck little LED torches to the front of them, um, and then that's that's the only thing I can fault with this thing at all. Um, I'm, sh I'm sure in, in the future sometime they're going to bring out a cordless version. Um, obviously, uh, Mathel work um, with Metabo with their battery platform. Um, they are arguably one of the best batteries in the world as well. So, um, be super excited to see a cordless one of these. But yeah, get out there, give this thing a try. Um, unfortunately, if you're in Australia like I am, um, you have to get them imported. Uh, Timberwolf Tools in um, Chicago um, are our probably best point of call to get one sent over. Obviously, we're going to be paying quite a bit in, uh, in shipping, um, but you will not regret them. Um, they're absolutely amazing, as you've seen. So if you like this video, um, give us a, a thumbs up or, or hit me in comments down in the section. Thanks, guys.